This is New Jersey's greatest concentration of population, finance, that's worn and blighted. But we have the spirit and vigor to grow and build anew, as here in the new campuses of Rutgers University and the newer College of Engineering. In time, they will accommodate 25,000 students, making Newark a college town. Newark has undertaken more urban renewal per capita than any other of the nation's 30 major cities. In our time, one-fifth of our city will have been rebuilt with projects like these. And like these, Hallmark House, 400 new in-city the new home of the Newark Star Ledger, as well a complex of multiple dwellings and business establishments. The 17 stories of the new Federal Office Building. Close by Center City and extending to its limits are our homes. Typical of the city's 17 public housing projects are the Scudder Homes in the Old Third Ward. North of Newark Center, as to the south and west, on farmlands of another era are the residential areas. And here, too, we're changing with the times. New high-rise apartments spike the skyline along Mount Prospect Avenue. Fresh new forces work to eliminate decay and provide the needs of a modern city. The Mies van der Rohe design colonnade apartments established the contemporary trend in multiple dwellings within the decade. Their three-part complex along Broad Street and Clifton Avenue, the first privately sponsored housing redevelopment in the city. image of a Newark tradition, Barringer High School. Here, too, rise the magnificent spires of Sacred Heart Cathedral. In the sun section of the city, we're changing, too, as apartment towers continue to rise along Elizabeth Avenue, looking out upon Wequaic Park. A treasured gift from the past as Branchbrook Park to the north, providing refuge and pleasure for our people. Industry, core of Newark's growth from the early 19th century, has been limited by lack of space. Now, modern engineering will reclaim and stabilize more than 1,500 acres of meadow land for industrial usage. Port New Vital Link to Nation World, the Port of New York Authority, having invested $86 million in its development since 1948, is now undertaking a new $12.5 million expansion program. Newark Airport one of the nation's busiest, representing $61 million investment for Authority since 1948. It's now undergoing a $150 million redevelopment by the Authority. This is Newark, 1966. 23 and a half square miles. Central city for four and a half million New Jerseymen. The home of 400,000, the workday center of other 300,000. With completion of present and renewal plans by 1970, private enterprise and government will have invested a total of $1 billion in new construction in our city. Yes, this is Newark 1960.